1047 KISS FM. It's John Jane Rich. It's time for War of the Roses. You think someone's cheating on you, we're going to help you find out the situation. So let's say hello to Dominic. Dominic, what's your situation? It's kind of a weird one. Uh, a couple weeks ago, my girlfriend and my best friend and I were all going to go out you know, for some, for some drinks at a bar, and my buddy doesn't drink. So it was like, okay, you, you drive. We get into the vehicle, and his Bluetooth picks up with my girlfriend's phone and immediately starts playing Olivia Rodrigo, like just like immediate connection. And I was like, whoa, whoa, wait a second. Why would her phone link up immediately to his car? I mean, that is kind of weird. Been, that takes up, that's a process. In. Yeah. You have to like, you know, you have to go in there, you have to program. And, uh, you know, she, she had turned it off and she, you know, try to play it off right away. And they start, trying to make jokes and i was like no no no, wait a second like it bothered me all night i was like no her phone linked up to the car immediately so i think something's going on here okay um i think you know what's an important part of the story is which olivia rodrigo song was being played <laughs> of course you do <laughs> because then it'd be like, oh it's vampire oh they're fine <laughs> <laughs> okay um what so you want us to call who i want you to call up my buddy Okay, what's Martin. his name? Martin. So we're going to call Martin. Martin. Okay. Yeah. So we're going to call Martin. I want, I, want, I, want, I want to see if we can trick him. <laughs> and we're going to see who he sends flowers to. So he could send flowers yeah. to your girlfriend. That's what you want to see. Exactly. Okay, and her name is what? Do we listen for her name? Ileana. Ileana. Okay, okay, man. All right, hold on a second, okay? We'll Where's get him me? on the phone. You stay quiet. We'll get him on the phone right now. Hi, is Martine Hello? available? Uh, yeah, this is Martine. Oh, perfect. So, Martine, it's kind of your lucky day. My name is Penny. I'm with a new company. We're called JNR Flowers. And the whole point of my phone call is so that we can get more people to know about us. So you have actually been chosen to be a micro-influencer for us, which means you get to send our most romantic bouquet of roses to whoever you want. And it's totally free for you. We just kind of ask that you post about us on whatever social media platform you use the most. Uh, okay. Uh, is this like a catch? What do I have to pay something or why? <laughs> no, why I mean, we, me? we can't really hunt you down if you don't post about us, but it gives us a little bit of marketing. And like I said, this, this bouquet of roses is so gorgeous. It is literally so romantic. We call it our pure passion bouquet. So think of someone that you want to send that message to. And then I don't need like personal information, like credit card or anything like that, but we will send it out with a nice card and you let me know what you want to write on the card and we can actually get them sent out today. So it's a win-win for everybody. Uh, all right, I guess. What do I have to lose? <laughs> exactly. Um, so like I said, we're going to send it out with a card. Um, you let me know the message you want to write on it. it. Like I said, the roses, pretty they send a message on their own, but this is your chance to get a little fun, flirty, dirty, whatever you want. Uh, don't be shy. I've kind of seen it all. Give me that message, and then we can go name an address, and we can get them sent out. Um, all right. You know, let's keep it simple. How about just... Uh, you're the best part of my days. I love that part of my days. Do you want like a love martine? Sure, yeah. Cute. Okay. And then we can exchange socials in a minute, but who do you want me to address this to? It's going to be to Liliana. Oh, my God. Okay, cool. Yeah, so now I'm going to have to beat your ass. What? Oh, hello? Hey, it's me. Hello? Martin, yeah, Dominic, what's up? Hold on, Dominic. Let me explain, Martin, what's happening. Martin, you're on the radio. You're on the John Jr. radio program. Dominic thought there was something going on between you and his girlfriend. Uh, dude, un- un- unbelievable! All, every every chick that you've dogged out, and I always had your back. And this is how you repay me. And we have conversations about this. And you're investing right, around you know with what? my girl behind my back, bro. Unbelievable. I, you know, I, I don't want to do this like this, but don't act brand new. You, you've never been good to what? Lily, and you just don't deserve her. So, you know what? I actually, I don't feel bad for you at all. Uh, she was already going to leave you, and she just didn't want to hurt your feelings. Whoa! So, wow. Whoa! That's Double how down, it is. really? You're you're the you're the you're the lowest scum, bro. You realize that, right? You realize? Nah, man. How, it's nah, it's you. That's why she's leaving you. 
I, you, this has been a long time coming. How long have you guys been friends? Okay. Uh, since Go we ahead, were bro. kids. <gasps> oh, oh my man. gosh. Bro code. It's the bro code. You're breaking the bro code. This is beyond bro code. This is like, this is like, brother, this is like, this is, this is so, ter- I mean, I, what would I expect from you, man? Dude, you've been like, acting like an absolute jerk for years. It's a long time coming. We should have, I mean, honestly, we should have stopped being friends a while ago, but you should have broke up with Liliana way sooner than that. Like, it's, this is all coming when it's supposed to. You, Sorry you're, if it you're, doesn't feel good, but. You're a sleazy, you're a sleazy coward, bro. You're a sleazy. Call me whatever you want. Behind my back. No Call me whatever you want. Whatsoever. You, sure. Bro, when I see yep, you, great. when I see you, it's going to, I'm going to throw hands, dude. I'm not even going to fucking hesitate. Cool. Well, I'm gonna call the cops. Uh, don't. You're, we're not gonna. Yeah, I'm do that. Do you, that. Okay? Do that because you're a coward. Typical of you. You got no cool, honor. Cool, cool, cool. Would you guys be willing yeah, to come on. in the studio and put on sumo suits and fight with big uh, inflatable sumo suits against each other in our studio? Listen, man. I I don't know if you're trying to be funny or I would, what, but I'm I am trying to be funny. Again. Would you be willing to have Liliana be maybe our ring girl? John Jay. Oh my I gosh. don't think you're helping a sensitive it's situation. Part, part, Wait, part, Martine, part, you said this part, has been a long time coming. Have you been hooking up with Liliana for years? Yeah. <gasps> yeah, maybe maybe two years now. That's brutal. Oh, that, like, yes. how could you do that to your friend? Mm-hmm. It's like, you know why I think this stings so much? It's like, for me, I think, like, best friend breakups are worse than, like, relationship breakups. And since you were kids, like, yeah. this just hits a different level of betrayal. Mm-hmm. And Dominic, yeah. didn't you say that uh, Martine kind of dogged out other women anyway? Uh, so often. So often. Like, just, it, he, he, he's, a, he's literally a slime bucket. And I have, like, stood by... And I've always found a reason to have his back, like, oh, well, she was this or this girl was that. And, you know, he's a, he's a cheater. He's a, he, he's a cheater. That's what he's doing now. He brought her into it. He, he poisoned her. You know, I, I, I could feel this. I could sense this. Wow. And all I needed was to hear a, a song play. Wow. All right. I'm yeah. honestly shocked it took you so long. I feel like you guys have some it. conversations to have with Liliana. Yeah. Yeah. That too. No, no he's not talking to her. All right, you guys. I think it sounds is. like there needs to be a guy trip. Make up. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> and he's going back. All right. <laughs> you guys got some. We, we, well, anyway, she's cheating on you. So that's what you wanted Sorry. to know. And it's happening, man. Thanks for being on the air, both of us. Both of you. Yeah. With all four of us. Yeah. And two of yeah. us. <laughs> all right. That's War of the Roses. John Jane Rich. Kiss FM.